Yo, what is up guys? It's the Goblin and welcome back to another Fortnite Battle Royale video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about account merging, which is finally here and the ability to transfer skins from an Xbox account to a PS4 account or different things like that. We're going to talk about that in today's video as well as some other stuff because there has been quite a bit of news going on in the Fortnite community as of late. If you guys could drop a like on this video, I'd very, very much appreciate that. Let's go ahead and go for 1500 likes. That would be absolutely amazing if we could hit that. And a big shout out to everyone who has subscribed to the channel and who has hit that notification bell and also everyone who is using my supporter creator the goblin yt in the fortnite item shop big shout out to everyone using my supporter creator i am very very thankful for that and i, I appreciate it so much so today we're going to talk about account merging now this is something that a lot of people have been asking for for a while and i know a lot of people want to know how to do it so i'm going to show you guys exactly how and talk about it in today's video so account merging is here and basically this allows you to transfer your skins your v bucks or different stuff like that from if you had an Xbox account over to a PS4 and um, basically merge them together so you're adding it all you're having everything that you want on the console or device that you want to play on from here on out now this works with older accounts that have been played on anytime before September 28th 28 2018 so pretty much any Xbox or PS4 accounts that aren't you know brand new within the next within the last like six months or so so in order to do this and if you guys do want to merge your accounts or transfer skins um, or transfer all your skins of V-Bucks from one account to another uh, through different consoles basically the link for that will be down in the description and I'll talk about it right now uh, right now uh, in this video on how to do it and basically your different options here so this is from the official uh, Epic Games website first of all you'll choose two accounts a primary account that you wish to continue using and then your secondary account to merge and disable so this is the one where everything is going to be transferred over completely everything you're merging it and then you're disabling that account so your secondary account is your console login of P example PSN Xbox Live and Nintendo Online will be instantly linked to your primary account. Two weeks later, your Fortnite cosmetic items and V-Bucks will be transferred to your primary account. So this is perfect for people that either have, a, you know, maybe you have a friend that has an Xbox account that they never use anymore that they don't want. Maybe you had an Xbox account and you moved over to PS4. Maybe you moved from a different way from a different console. And I'm not sure if this is going to add like some sort of problem with people selling like other accounts and then merging them together with their own. I'm not sure about that. Um, but basically this is uh, a lot of people in specific situations have been asking for this and while this doesn't really affect everyone because not everyone is going to have two accounts to merge um, this is something that is definitely unique and this, the amount of like cross play and like ability to merge between different platforms and connect on everything has been amazing through Fortnite. So basically that's how it works. So it'll be instantly linked to your primary account and then two weeks later your Fortnite cosmetic items and V-Bucks will be transferred to your primary account. So by doing this you are disabling. You're merging that secondary account, you're transferring everything from that secondary account to that primary account and you are merging and disabling that secondary account. So make sure you guys do know that before you do that if you go through with this. Uh, make sure you put the right one, the right account that you want in the primary and in the secondary. So important info one account must have played on Xbox One or Switch and the other on PS4 before September 28th, 2018 to be eligible. So those are your console restrictions. Your account must not currently be banned or disabled. Pretty obvious rule. In-game items and V-Bucks will be held for two weeks before they're merged to your primary account. You'll need access. I'm not sure why they are held for two weeks either. You might want to look into that more. I don't, I'm not sure what that process is. I'm not sure why it's not exa uh, you know, right away. Uh, maybe they just have to make sure nothing fishy has gone on with those accounts and maybe that is to pre prevent account selling or anything. I'm, I'm really not sure why that is there uh, or what the reasoning is behind that, but I'm sure there is a reason for it. So in-game items of V-Bucks held for two weeks before they merge to the primary account. You'll need access to all email addresses that are associated with accounts you wish to merge. If you have a duplicate third-party login like Facebook on both your primary and secondary account, the secondary login will be unlinked. You can unlink it prior to merging. And Battle Royale will, will allow you to merge all cosmetic items. All cosmetic items in Battle Royale Save the world will allow you to merge llamas, defenders, heroes, schematics, survivors, XP, evolution, and perk materials. Other items such as Unreal Marketplace items, Creative Islands, and Save the World account level and progress will not be merged over from your secondary account. So that's basically what it is. You can link console, you can now link your console logins and merge Fortnite cosmetic items and V-Bucks from one account to another. So for everyone that was excited for that, that is now there, and that is how you can do it through that link in the description. For other news that we have to talk 
talk about basically. Um, there is a new free Fortnite wrap which will uh, basically starting on February 8th to the 22nd. Players who enter any creator code during that time will receive a free Cuddle Hearts wrap. And so this is really, really cool. My supporter creator, of course, is the Goblin YT right up there in the left. So make sure to use mine in the item shop. I really do appreciate everyone supporting me there. It is, it's, it's amazing. It really is. And basically, you just have to use anyone's and you're going to get this starting February 8th to the 22nd. And I believe they also are doing a boost to the supporter creator. Um, percentages and stuff for that specific uh, uh, area so it's going to be really really crazy and hopefully a lot of amazing skins are going to be dropping and just thank you to everyone that's supporting me and continuing to support me in the item shop it really does help out a, a lot and i know it's super, something super simple to do but it does help out in in really really amazing ways and the next thing we have to talk about for the rest of this video is the leak around the valentine the valentine's day dark challenges and rewards coming to fortnite so there's been some different leaks and you know how fortnite has been doing these sort of implementing these limited time challenges has been their sort of go-to move for the last little bit um, uh, that they've done uh, and basically uh, there's been quite a few little leaks and there's been leaks around the Love Ranger skin which will be back into the shop of course on Valentine's Day February 14th but it will also be in there with an unlockable dark style that will according to these leaks not be a separate cosmetic and there are basically uh, a drawing here this is like I think uh, basically just a, a concept art so I don't know if it's going to look exactly like this but of course it looks like we will be getting some sort of an unlockable dark style so if you already have the love ranger this is really good news if you don't of course you're going to be able to purchase it then um there also looks like there will be some sort of challenges available and basically uh with the challenges we don't really know what the rewards are going to be but it looks like it could possibly be a themed pickaxe or a back bling to go with the you know the dark love ranger with those challenges and that is kind of exciting and definitely something that uh, you could look forward to if you are um, you know these limited challenges and these limited events are pretty exciting I like when you know like during winter time when the item shop was going crazy all the time and it was new skins out of nowhere even when some of the skins weren't even being leaked that stuff was absolutely absolutely crazy and amazing but it looks like this is something that unless they change their mind and decide to scrap this we're gonna be getting some sort of Valentine's Day challenges or even if they, they scrap those at least we're gonna be getting this um, you know version of the Love Ranger and uh, that seems pretty cool. They did this with like a bunch of other skins, bringing back old skins, adding new uh, customizable styles to them. And it's it's different because in certain times, like when they brought back not the bright bomber but the dark bomber, that one was like a completely different skin. But sometimes when when they do it, it's an unlockable style. So I guess it just all depends. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today's video. That's everything about account merging around the supporter creator, the Goblin YT, and around these leaked Valentine's Day dark challenges and stuff like that. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy this video. I'll leave you guys with the rest of this uh, gameplay. This is an, an older gameplay of a actually a crazy win that I cut up real quick here to uh, show you guys for the rest of this video if you guys want to check it out. And drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.